and Spark uh, with all that. I, okay, um, I see what you're saying. Uh, Peach's reverse neutral B. I'm yep. sorry, reverse Parasol. Uh, Mario's reverse up B. Yeah. Anything with an auto link angle, that's like a multi-hit move. Right. Um, Little Mac as well, it's happened with. Bayo's up B. Um, honestly, if they just fix the, the like, the way that auto link work. angles worked, yeah. um, then Rage wouldn't be so devastating. Um, a lot of people are like, oh, bad Rage, all these things are so dumb, but like you literally just have to fix the auto link angles. That's fair. That's um, fair. Because then all it's really going to affect is Bowser's up smash kills early. Yeah, exactly. Like, hell, it should. You know, it, an actual reward for... Or, yeah, kind of a reward for playing a heavy, a little bit of a bonus for surviving. Yeah. But that's an interesting take on it, actually. I don't, I don't disagree with that whatsoever. All right, we got losers finals. Zach and Lemon. These um, two trade sets. If you've, uh, if you've been watching any of the weeklies, it's it's fairly back and forth between these guys. Yeah, from what I understand, when Zach does go Diddy, it's mostly in Zach's favor, but. Yeah. Um, He's broken up the cloud the past few weeks. Yeah. And uh, he's shelved it for now. Probably the right call. Yeah, this is an interesting matchup because Diddy definitely Ooh. wins neutral pretty hard. Sure. But if he gets... Um, wow. Good SDI. His, he's very combo food, and sometimes, like, the SS's up B works in weird ways with him, and, like, I don't know. It's always interesting watching this set. For sure. That's... Oh, man. It's one that the uh, Smash 4 community grew to, well, maybe grew to love, maybe grew to tolerate. Because you would see uh, Nairo and Zero a lot. Mm -hmm. um, and it's not like either of these two characters were ever uncommon, so you'd see it at your own weeklies like we do here. Yeah. Uh, I don't really know who actually does win this. I think, like you, you were saying, it's just a difference between do you want to win neutral more or do you want to win your one exchange that little bit harder. Yeah. Um, yeah, it's really interesting. Like, there are a lot of points in time where Diddy will just be sitting there and holding Banana. Yep. But um, with how safe ZSS's aerials are, if she spaces properly, um, there are sometimes when Diddy can't even really use uh, Banana properly. Mm -hmm. um, you really have to whiff punish ZSS. You can't let that Nair or up air hit your shield. And Nair is just a wonderful move on ZSS. Combos, fairly safe, decent damage. What more do you want? Yeah, if you jab out of it, it's almost completely safe. Unless you, I guess, you power shield it. Sure. Well, yeah, I guess. Is there anything safe on power shield? Wow. Yeah, yeah. There's, there's things. Really? Yeah. Oh. Some of Ryu's moves are safe on power shield. Um, Ryu's focus attack is. Yeah. Okay. Like level three. Level one. Really. Coming down. You just have to be coming down from the air at the same time. Oh. Um, and then cancel the leg. There are other moves too. Um, things like Ryu down tilt. Stuff that you can mash super fast. Oh, uh, yeah, okay. Um, or multi-hit moves. Right, yeah, because then it's no longer a power shield. Well, actually, if you power shield the first hit of a multi-hit move, yep. and you hold shield for the whole multi-hit move, and then you drop it at the end, yep. it counts as if you power shielded the last hit. Cool. Yeah, it's something that not a lot of people know, but it, it does actually make a difference to uh, power shield multi-hit moves. Okay. Well, here we go into game two, taking it to town and city instead of Smashville. A little bit of a lower ceiling, help Lemon with those ladders, but maybe Zach can make something of those this time around. Yeah, I think, hmm, I don't know. I know Zach loves this stage because Diddy's setups just kill earlier. He doesn't have that like issue killing. He can do the up throw like 50-50s um, on DI and that, that kind of can. stuff. Um, but against ZSS, this is scary. This is one of ZSS's best stages. Yeah, that's handing your opponent a gun and giving yourself you know, a slightly bigger gun. Yeah. It's, it's not not your favorite thing to do, but it's fair. But then again, comfort is a big thing, and this yep. is what Zach's most comfortable on. I think that makes a lot of sense. For sure. Hey, there's, there comes a point in time where both characters are just going to benefit the same. You just need to help yourself. Oh, man. So you can see Lemon's fishing for, like, a bigger opening at this percent. He's either looking for that grab. He's looking for a nair. Um, he's not even trying to hit Zach with anything, like, that isn't uh -oh. going to set up something. He doesn't want to waste this this golden percent almost for him. Yeah, Zero Suit is kind of like Donkey Kong in that sense that, like, no there are specific percents that, like, she can do a lot more with. Oh, high wow. monkey flip. Uh, that's something Zach does not like to do, but yeah. 
I've I've heard many a time him complain about the high monkey flip and how he just shouldn't do it, but he gets caught for that one. Oh no. No way. Okay. All right. Oh wow, <laughs> I thought he slipped out there for a moment. He did go for that um, re-grab, but he was facing the wrong way. He would have been if he would have done a pivot grab or he would have been facing the right way. That was dead for Diddy for sure. Yeah, no chance of surviving that. The first up air connects and then you just immediately up B, I'd have to assume. Yeah. With the amount of rage that was sitting on him? I think, had he died, I, my mind's blanking. Yeah, he had a lot of rage. Yeah. Oh yeah, because he died to up smash a moment later. Uh-oh, losing the banana. This could be rough. Not right. enough. Oh. Zack missed his tech, but luckily Lemon found himself on a banana. Banana come in clutch, not letting Lemon get a conversion off of uh -oh. there. He's gonna have to monkey flip. No, he's gonna use the barrels. The Zach's been doing really, really good with his barrel angles. Mm -hmm. uh, really? Oh, I thought that killed. No, not quite. Yeah. If you got the DI mix up, it definitely would have, but. A little too hopeful there on my part. Uh oh. Wow. Yeah, he's very in. Good. He's still there. See, that's one of the situations where it's really scary. Like, you don't wanna. Oh god. Jeez. You don't want to DI in, you don't want to DI out, like I have no idea down. what I would have done in that situation. DI out and then once it gets to the later part of the hit, DI in? Maybe. I have no idea. That's yeah. I probably actually wouldn't have touched my stick. That's yeah, no, understandable. Up tilt? Mm, that will both seal them it. going for those killing up tilts. Wow. Zach's gonna be the one that connects. Yeah, got out that shield and you know, allowed him allowed him to win that exchange. Oh, oh, okay. We're good. ZSS's up tilt would be so much better if it was single hit for killing situations, but it's so good that it's multi-hit for earlier percents. Yeah. Uh, with how much intangibility it has on it. Got more chance to catch, a little bit more uh, chance to act out of it. We're going into game three, taking it back to Town and City which would be uh, Lemon's counter pick. So he was definitely happy with the stage. Not gonna blame that for his loss. Something uh, something of his own. So far, you know, it's it's looking a little bit like the previous game. Both players are kind of taking each other taking each other for a ride whenever they get the opportunity to, and Lemon's gonna look for one oh, here. Oh, that's, ooh, wow. definitely didn't want to miss that jump there. No, that was strange that he missed it. I, I've not seen something like that from him for a very long time. It's not not common. And just like that, Zach's already evened this back up. Evened, and he's going to take a stock for it. A lot of people tell me Diddy can't kill early. <laughs> but for the amount of times I've seen down tilt F smash kill at like 80%, that Eight. is some that is some 80s garbage. early in this game. <laughs> like, that is yeah. that's very early in this game. Killing before 100. If you kill before 100, you've done good for yourself. Especially on a character with such good neutral. Yeah, yeah, like, that's something you don't take into consideration with Diddy Kong. He's great in neutral and has that kill power, like I'm trying to say. All right, Ooh. back air will kill. 78% already racked up on Lemon. Most people would look at that like, oh, Lemon's kind of in a rough spot, but it almost might be uh, more of a gift to him. Yeah, if he gets about 20 more percent, those uh, those grabs will start to become very, very threatening. And I think we're moving on to the, yes, we are moving on to the triple platform now. So he's going to be able to get that up on the edge. Just gets through it. Zach cannot afford another one of those. No way. No, he did DI yeah. out, but it wasn't quite enough to kill. That will be. Yep, that was very, very good for Zach. Man. He took his time, he hit him with the banana, waited a second. Thought about what his confirm was going to be, and then got the down tilt up smash. Someone's got like a stir fry. It smells really good. Oh, yeah, it does. Nice. Yeah, is that going up 2 1, taking uh, taking the win on Lemon's counter pick, and the bail is going to come out. I don't know how I feel about this. Um, about three, four weeks ago, Lemon tweeted out that he hated playing against uh, against Diddy Kong, and that, that tournament he had used Bayo pretty much exclusively. So I'm going to have to assume. It might have been a, a little yeah. bit Bayo specific. And Zach is good at this matchup. Like it's not like a matchup that he struggles in. No, not not in the slightest. And, and it's, it's a matchup you should struggle in almost a little bit as Diddy. 
I think like the reason this matchup is so hard mm -hmm. is like you li you have to wait for Diddy to do something first, and that's so difficult to do in a lot of situations. Um, like you see, Lemon's trying to make openings here by yep. going in first, and he's getting punished for it every time. Um, I kind of did the same thing in my set. Yeah. Um, but yeah, not to call you out, but Zach punished you in one of the games on literally every single heal slide that you pulled. Yeah. Well, I also only heal slide at that game, so. That's um yeah, it's a fair statement. <laughs> there was a lot of heel slide from you on uh, on that one. Yeah, but um, but I definitely think this matchup is a lot better for Bayo if they just literally let Diddy Kong do his thing first just and then punch. punish. It requires a lot of patience though. Like I think Salem is the best um, the best Bayo at this matchup, and it really comes down to like waiting and taking your punishes. Yeah, the records. Uh the record books will definitely show that he was pretty good at the Diddy Kong matchup. Yes. A couple, a couple notable people he might have beaten that are uh, good at this character. Oh. It looked like that banana was going to just get over the platform, but hangs up there and not going to get much use out of it. Now, Zach has a habit of DIing out on um, Witch Twist, mm -hmm. which isn't necessarily a bad thing. He's DIing out and down right now. Um, and Lemon hasn't covered it yet, so we'll see if he figures out a way to cover that DI. Oh, not going to be able to get the grab. Unfortunate for Zach, would have led to a little bit more of that percent that he so desperately needs, but if he keeps getting this rage, he might just be able to seal it out regardless. Ooh, he did ha cover that roll, but he didn't actually believe in himself to, to punish it. Had everything but an actual uh, hitbox up there. Zach's looking around. He's got a grab. He's just gonna reach for a foyer though. Not sure why. Lemon. Ooh, that was really nice. Wow. Caught that. Oh my goodness, okay. <laughs> um, the sliding onto Lilat with that monkey flip. The stage has some really interesting physics. Yeah. Um, the sliding down some of the lips and that kind of thing. That's gonna do it. Yep. Wow, and Zach with a three, was that three two? Yeah, three one. Or three one, sorry. Well, there we go.